A to prepare 250 ml of M by 30 oxalic acid solution. B using M by 30 oxalic acid solution as a standard solution. Find the molarity and strength of the given sodium hydroxide NaOH solution. In a titration, a carefully measured volume of a solution of known concentration called the titrend is added to a measured volume of a solution containing a compound whose concentration is to be determined. Ma'am, how can we find the molarity and strength of the given solution? Using the following calculations. M1 V1 oxalic acid is equal to M2 V2 NaOH. M1 is equal to molarity of oxalic acid. V1 is equal to volume of oxalic acid. Pipit 1 by 30 into 10 is equal to M2 into X. V2 is equal to burette reading concordant M2 is equal to 1 by 3 x mole per liter. Strength is equal to molarity into molar mass is equal to M2 into 40 grams per liter. Let's do an experiment to prepare 250 ml of M by 30 oxalic acid solution. Using M by 30 oxalic acid solution as a standard solution, find the molarity and strength of the given sodium hydroxide solution. Our aim here is A. To prepare 250 ml of M by 30 oxalic acid solution. B. Using M by 30 oxalic acid solution as a standard solution, find the molarity and strength of the given sodium hydroxide NaOH solution. The materials required are Burette 50 ml, Pipette 10 ml, Small beaker 100 ml, Volumetric flask, Conical flask, Test tube, oxalic acid, crystals, sodium hydroxide solution, watch glass, balance, weight box, distilled water, phenolphthalein as indicator. Procedure Preparation of standard solution Measure and weigh exactly 1.05 gram of oxalic acid. Take a volumetric flask and transfer 1.05 gram of oxalic acid in it and dissolve it in minimum amount of distilled water. Make up the volume to the mark and shake the solution using a stop cock. Finally, make up the volume to 250 ml mark on volumetric flask. Titration of NaOH and oxalic acid. Fill the burette with NaOH2 zero mark after rinsing the burette. Read the lower meniscus. Check by passing the solution through stop cock so that no air bubble is left and the glass bulb is filled properly. Pipette out 10 ml of oxalic acid in the conical flask from beaker. Add about 2 to 3 drops of phenolphthalein in the conical flask. Now titrate the acid in conical flask with the sodium hydroxide solution in burette by adding drop by drop into the conical flask with constant shaking. The end point is reached with the appearance of baby pink color which indicates the neutralization of the acid. Repeat the procedure and take at least 3 readings out of which at least 2 readings are concordant and record the observations. Do not forget to keep sample color of neutralized solution to compare in each reading. Observations Serial number Initial reading of burette Final reading of burette, volume of NaOH used, concordant reading is equal to X, volume of pipette is equal to 10 ml. Result, the molarity of given NaOH solution is X mole per liter and the strength is X gram per liter. Precautions, do rinse the apparatus before use, clean the glassware before and after use, measure and weigh exact amounts. The color of solution being neutralized at end point should be exactly the same at concordant reading. Thank you ma'am for this knowledgeable experiment.